guys. So they told me to walk up this because this is their signature hole, hole 14. It's a reachable par four. And uh, I'm just gonna give you the view because it's kind of sweet. They carved out the walkway for when you're walking this course and I'll show you what it looks like because it's really dope. Wow, this is sick. And then you come up here. Got it. Woo! I'm out of breath. All right, how wait? Do people walk up that with their bags? The only LS caddies go around the mountain. Oh, okay. Because so that's a little steep. Caddies will give them a driver and maybe like a 200 shot, and then we're gonna go around the mountain and meet them out. Meet them out. <laughs> Holy cow! It's a tough I was about to say. Woo! I just ate that little uncrustable and I'm feeling it right now. <laughs> All right, going right into it. Hole 13, drivable par four. What's the distance? Uh, from here, I'm gonna say what's about 320. 320 from here. Yeah, I guess you have two options. Either go big or you can kind of lay up and have a little wedge. So I'm just gonna step back. I'm almost out of breath, I'm gonna pass out. But just look at this. Scenic view here. It's underneath the trees, you can see the rest of the course. So sick. All right, knock one on the green. Oh, God, I missed that. That's a good miss. See, that's a good miss, though. Yeah. Like, Ugh. your miss is like just maybe five yards shorter than normal and in the fairway. Oh, God, I missed that. That's a good miss. See, that's a good miss, though. Yeah. Like, Ugh. your miss is like just maybe five yards shorter than normal and in the fairway. Ooh. Ooh. That might do it. That looks good. That, that might good. do it. That might do it. <laughs> that one was good there. <laughs> Guys, I apologize. I'm not filming enough. But this course is just, it's hard to like bust out my camera. In film, you know. All right, let's see what Fuji's got here. Nipped it good. Needs to sit. Spin back. Yep, great shot. Gonna have about a 10-footer. Your boy actually got it on the green, which is great. And I've got maybe 25 feet or so here. But, but looking back at it, look at that. That is um, unbelievable. Such a beautiful hole. Back down, come back left. Okay. Eh. Good putt. Yeah, safe putt. Don't want to fly that one by. Pour it in on them. Great putt, man. Thanks. Fantastic. This is also the sweet thing about this, guys, is just how I feel like the coals are very connected. So we just finished 13. And we're moving on now to the par four. No, the next no par the three. Point. Par three, excuse me, hole 13, or hole 14, par three. Oh, thank you. You're welcome. Um, but look at this, you just walk straight off the green from 13. And you go straight up in this tee box that's basically just cut out of the rock. Now, how do they make grass grow up on here? I have no idea. But they do it and it looks absolutely pure. And then you walk out here and this is what you get. Look at that. So I'm not much for like, I haven't really spent too much time learning about golf courses, but I'll tell you this one's really sweet how it just, every hole feels connected. It's almost like telling a story one hole to the next. So hole 14, par three, we got 165. 165 flag. Time to stick one close, folks. Pures it with a nice cut going right at the pin. Should be about pin high, 10 feet. Very nice. Might be even better than that. Wow, great shot. Ah! Caught low in the face. Can you take your bird in there? Just short. Bobcat. There's a bobcat up there, guys. Let's see if I can get it. 
Oh, it's just in the brush right here. It's just right back there. Oh, you hear it meow? That's it. Is that meowing? Yes. Yeah, like little babies. Oh, maybe yeah. It's like oh, like its little cubs are back there? That's so cool. Fuji hit a really freaking good chip in here. Or, sorry, a really good tee shot. Uh, he's got like about 12, 13 footer for his birdie. I came up kind of short, kind of thinned it. I think I probably landed a few yards short here and just kind of fell off the back. Uh, my camera's about to die, so I will probably just give you an update on what happens here. All right, guys, I chipped mine in to about six inches for par. There's the birdie butt. Great roll. Does it stay in the line? Oh, it catches the lip. Brutal. Good par though. Good par. Number one handicap, hole 15, 512 yards. Elevated tee box as you can see. Our buddy's way down there. And uh, yeah, just grip it and rip it. Keep it out of the desert. Should be living large. Great shot. Looks really good. That was perfect. Yeah, I need that. That was really good. I need that. All right, I hit a really good drive out here, found the fairway. Got about like 170 or so left in. Cody's out doing drill and stuff, so kind of trying to scramble and film this on myself, guys. And the battery's about to die, so I'm trying to conserve, so you might not see this shot, but uh, I'll let you know where it goes. Uh, I went a tiny bit right. Carry a little, be good. Carry a little. Okay. Is that like a pretty severe two-tier green? And I uh, think I hit it on the wrong tier. He's just gonna have a slight uphill chip. <laughs> All right, missed a little left here. He's got himself a little chip. And then I was a little short. Didn't really catch all of it. Look at the sun flare though. I'm over on the right-hand side. He's coming up, really, really rolling out. Gonna have a little putt. And this is where I got, and this is the shot that I'm left with. Pretty fun and delicate. All right, we didn't play that hole too well, guys. Kind of butchered it a little bit. Oh, let's see a fris. Let's see a frisbee trick shot. <laughs> right through the gap. Come on. Through the gap. Through the gap. Oh! <laughs> All right, this is a little more doable. Here we go. This is the one. Frisbee trick shot, putter cover. Oh, straight to the cactus. <laughs> you had a really good one. I didn't get it on camera. <laughs> Shit got on camera. You guys, trust me, it was a really good one. Hole 16, par 5, 536 large ones. Looks like it's a little baby dog dog leg to the right. You got bunkers protecting both sides of the fairway. Uh, another shot just to try to boost one out there and see what we can do. Cut. Keep cutting. Keep, Keep cutting. All right, I went over the bunker. Over the bunker. Should be all right. Yeah. Oh, they're just behind us, nice. Yes, sir. Hang on, hang on, hang on. Should hit soft. Yeah, all you're right. fine. Cody is back, guys. What's up, guys? How was the drones? It was crazy. Good, good shots? The hour was amazing out here. Okay, all the drone work, this guy right here, so you can thank him for the six shots, guys. My battery's gonna die, so perfect timing to come back and film the uh, last three holes. I'm gonna get Brody with this, my the fake hiss a lot snake. So we'll get him probably here in the next few holes. <laughs> Doesn't set up well here. Fuji's in uh, on on in three. He's got a good like uh, 18 footer for birdie. I came up just short with the hybrid. Got to have a little up and down for birdie here. Got to make this. All right, what are we thinking? Just land it kind of on that flat part and just let it release. I agree, yeah. Just get it up this little slope. Yeah, and it's not gonna do much. I'm thinking pretty straight. Yeah, I don't see it much. Right where I wanted to land it. And hit it. One thing I'm really enjoying about filming these course vlogs and being able to watch them back is being able to actually see where my mistakes are. Here, as you can see with my hand gesture, I actually thought the putt went right and not left. When you watch it, I actually just 
putt the ball about a ball out to the right instead of inside the cup like the caddy had suggested. So a lot of tips and stuff I can pick up by watching my game and I highly suggest you guys film your swing or even film you guys playing so you can pick up on stuff as well when you're actually not on the course. Hole 17, ladies and gentlemen. We got two holes left out here. Whisper Rock, what a course, what an experience. 422 yards, par four. It's kind of sweet, you can kind of see the shadows and the sun out there beaming on the rocks and the grass. Uh, bunkers on the right and the left, per usual out here. Lots of desert, just gotta find the fairway. Looks like there's a rabbit or something out there, way out there. Gotta find the fairway, try to get another one on the green here. That went dead straight. Yep. That is perfection. Great shot. Thank you. <laughs> Absolutely plastered this drive. Hit it really well. But we're over here in a tricky situation. We got trees. What are you thinking? What's what's the play here? Because we got this in front of us. Yeah, I think we, we got that go, over there. We gotta go under this. Under this so, one, over the other one? Yeah, I like that. I think a little, a little like a knockdown. Gap wedge? What yeah. is, what's the distance? 104. Yeah, a little knockdown gap. It's gonna have to hit perfect, pretty much. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> can't be too high, can't be too low. And it's gotta cover that bunker there on the left. So this is a high, uh, lot, lot of, lot of ways of making a bad shot here. So gotta get all those bad thoughts out. Just gotta flight it a little bit with rice so we gotta put it in the back of our stand. Gotta flight it a little bit here. Do I A, hit it on the green, B, hit it into the tree, or C, miss the green completely and absolutely embarrass myself? He pulled it off. <laughs> nice. All right, it didn't hit a tree. You can't complain there. <laughs> Let's go. Congratulations, if you guess A, you were correct. If you guess B or C, I don't blame you. I was playing terrible and I probably would have guessed that myself. I pushed it out to the right. Oh, you had it. I pushed it out to the right. It was right over that though. I maybe missed it by a ball or two to the right. Did you? Yeah, and then oh. just didn't hit it. Nice par. I'll take a par from there. Par from the trees ain't bad. All right, moving on to hole 18. How do we feel about hole 18? It's pretty good. solid, oh, good fishing hole. One of the best hole. ones, yeah. One of the best fishing holes, that's what I like to hear. We got the sunset Long, like, coming right, down. Water all up the right side. Water? Oh yeah. Oh boy, we're in golden hour right now. Just look at me right here, perfect. That's just, that's just what the people came to see. Gonna try to flush another drive probably and uh, call it a day. Wrap it up, Whisper Rock, it's been fun. And we have made it. Hole number 18 out at Whisper Rock. Par four, 501 buccarinos. Two bunkers off to the left. Water running all down the right hand side. Got to put one in play here. Finish strong. Let's do it, folks. Might catch that bunker. Yeah. Oh, well Ooh. done, sir. Just pipes it right down the middle. Just the way, like, the, the rocks and stuff. Just a nice contrast between the rocks getting hit by the sun and in the grass. Oh! Film it, film it, film it. Film it. Oh, is that fake? Oh my gosh, did you just got set him, me up? Got him. <laughs> Dang. You like, I was like, film it, film it. We got a rattlesnake on camera. Dude! Oh. Oh, yeah. That looks so real. I still, I'm not even going over it because I still think it's real. Okay, it's completely <laughs> fake. Wow. Yeah, okay, that got me. <laughs> that got me. 220 fairway bunker. Found it. Uh, water on the right hand side. Pretty dangerous looking shot. I'm gonna aim for the left side of the green, and hopefully I don't chunk this. Chunk this one. I mean, I've had two really bad fairway bunker shots. It's impossible to have three. So, I feel like this one's gonna be good. Yeah, good nah, just short. I 
I feel like all these bunkers, I'm just getting it a little heavy every time. I hit that really well though. Does, do bunker shot, fairway bunkers normally like you want to club up one? Um, no I don't. Or normally you should still get the same distance? Yeah, I just I suck. Okay, uh, hole 18. Who did you decide this bot? Would you have 230? Yeah, 230 hitting it inside of tour average. <laughs> it's true though. I got like lucky. 20 got feet. Lucky. That's got a great lucky. shot with all this water on the left. I came up well short. What else is new? Fairway bunker. Got to get up and down to par this hole. Right. Kind Dang of a tough it. pin for where you're at. Pearl. Oh, no turn. Good run though. Thank you. I like inside right uphill. Alright, I can dig that. Throw it in. All I'm thinking about right now is I don't make this putt. I'm not making the cut. My kids aren't having food on the table. <laughs> like just so many thoughts in my head. It's like I must make putt. My freaking wife's on my back. She wants a new purse, you know, just all these thoughts in my head. Hey, he makes it. Gosh! <laughs> <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen. How good was that? Good way to finish. How yeah. good. Nice. What a round, boys. It was an absolute pleasure. pleasure man. Absolute Very pleasure. Nice to meet you. Absolute Go pleasure. Thanks so fun. much for having me fun. out. Food. Guys, that was a lot of fun. <laughs> Had a blast out here. Uh, what can I say about this course? Absolutely dime piece, I guess. Can I say that? Is that family friendly? I'm not yeah. sure. But yeah, it was absolutely pure. Um, had a great time. And like I said, when you're playing golf with good people, it doesn't really matter what you score. It's all about the experience. And out here, Whisper Rock, great experience. Thanks so much for having me. Make sure you subscribe. Check out PXG The Experience. Go to their PXG website. Experience. All that will be in the description down below. Had a blast. We'll see you in the next one. Like, subscribe, comment, and we'll see you later. So this is where I actually met Ben and John Rom for the first time. A little extra bonus footage. I ended up Instagram living it, but we got some behind the scenes of that, and I thought I'd show you that now. Their 18-hole showdown. Here it is. Enjoy. Brody and Cody. Hey, so what's man. up, man? Brody, nice to meet you. Do you, you guys mind if I go Instagram live this last hole? That's good. You're in? What the right. is about to you get. in? <laughs> yeah. He wants people to see you. That's cool with me. How many down are you? What do you mean? I'm, I got my press. Live on the IG. All right, give the people the update. What's going down? You guys playing a match? We sure are. Match going down. Who's, who's the team? Or is it all? No, it's, it's indie game. One v one. We're all playing against this man back here. This is the ringer right here. Ringer. I wheeled everybody. Oh boy. Come get me. <laughs> All right. Three wood. Real thing. I'm not gonna second guess him. <laughs> <laughs> you could. Mm. It's just, oh. it's a different sound. <laughs> mm. He just that, need the camera on. Honestly, the, the <laughs> yeah, no, I like <laughs> describing Damn. the shot. Apparently you like the moment, huh? I think just, that's the yeah, I'm kind of used to it. <laughs> just came out doing work. Smokes it. You in the short alley? Just to... uh, Harry says, "Great, great hit." Thank you. Thanks, Harry. <laughs> oh, all right, John. Yeah, that comes out hot. Are you, are you going to give us a breakdown what's going to go down on 18? Could you just you smoke the three ways? So on 18, the breakdown on 18, yeah. I played I played a really good front nine. Okay. Uh, What'd you shoot? I shot six down there on the front. What? <laughs> so, what you okay. Doing? So I won the All front. Right. And okay. then on the back nine, we're actually pretty even. Uh, okay. We're, I'm one up on the back nine and all square on the press. So this whole... This is matters. This matters this a matters. lot to him. So I, I won the front on the total already. Okay. So, so you're it matters a lot. And what what shoes are you wearing? Are these, are these like the like kind of tennis shoes, but with spikes? Oh, these are golf shoes. Dang. This is freaking. Let me tell you something. These only matters, bro. Nah. Oh, the, oh, the Jays? Jordans. Come on, man. Piers, right at the pin, a little to the right. It's got to get up just a little bit. Sound like green. Yeah. About like 20 feet. footer for uh, the bird. Nice shot. 
feel like I'm on tour today. Yeah, you got it. <laughs> I'm just trying to give you the pressure, you know. Just, Cameras on 18. You know, coming you just out. came out here. You got the press coming out on 18. Get an inside look. Hanging out to the right a little bit. All right. Oh, bad. Just out to the right. It's all right, though. It's all right, though. People want uh, me to challenge you to a game of Frisbee golf. That's what people are saying. <laughs> when, when, have you ever played Frisbee golf? Have you ever gone out and, and no, done that? I've never seen one. I haven't played. You've never seen a disc golf course nope. with, like, the chains and stuff? No, never. Really? I mean, no. I'm surprised. I think you would like it a little bit. You I basically, would. You basically I'm not good at Frisbee throwing, so I don't know. Dude, five minutes, I could teach you how to throw a Frisbee. Awesome. Is mine then just basically gonna fall right? I think you gotta be pretty close to straight. Yeah. I don't know, I still yeah. see it going a little. Let's I'll give go, it inside I'll go left. I'll go. No more than edge. You yeah. go. Oh. Thank Good you. Pot. Good pot. Back. Mm. That was nice for the amateur. <laughs> I thought you had that birdie. Yeah, I know I needed it. <laughs> <laughs> Got him. Got him. <laughs> You're added to the compilation. The I Fuji Snake compilation. Oh no. So you don't mess with that. You don't do that. You don't do that. <laughs> <laughs> you don't do that in a course that's very strong possibility. <laughs> <laughs> 